I'm going to show you how to go from this to this. And all I did was change the lighting using the AI software Claude and Runway ML. Okay, so here's our original clip. This was not generated with AI. This is an actual clip shot on the Sony a7S III. And as you can see here, we've got, we've got some good backlighting going on, but we want to diffuse the lighting more, make it more of an overcast setting, and add a big key light in onto her face here. So I'm gonna show you how to do that. So to start off, we're gonna take a screenshot of this image here. And then next we're gonna head over to Claude. I'm gonna hit this plus sign. I'm gonna click upload file. Okay, next we're gonna write a prompt similar to this. Okay, so this prompt says, create a prompt for runway. Use this image as a reference. Write the prompt using JSON. Change the lighting from sunny to diffused and cloudy to overcast. Add an HMI, heavily diffused key light to the front of her face. Add diffused sunlight behind her, creating a soft hair light on her. I will be putting this video that the screenshot was taken from into runway and telling the program to change these elements on the video. Keep it slightly under a thousand words. Okay, so once you write out your prompt, we're going to click run and I'll explain what this is doing here. So now Claude is making a more detailed prompt using the code JSON. JSON is great because it's easier for AI to read JSON than it is for them to read normal English. Okay, so next we're gonna come over to Runway. And over here I have the chat mode enabled. And what we'll do is we'll hit this plus sign. Okay, so let's go ahead and add in our original video clip. Okay, then I'm gonna go back to Claude and I'm going to come up here to where this little clipboard icon is and I'm gonna click copy. And then we'll go back to Runway. And then I'll go ahead and paste this by hitting Command V on my keyboard or if I'm on a PC, I'll hit Control V. Okay, so once the video is in and the prompt that was generated in Claude is in, you're gonna come down here and you're gonna hit this Ask button. And then once you do that, it's going to generate your first video. Now, you're probably not going to get the video that you want on the first try with this prompt. So there is a process you have to go through here to get this to be correct. So what you're gonna do is if it doesn't come out the way you want it to, then what you'll do is you'll come back over to Claude and you'll make specific adjustments down here to this prompt up here. And then what will happen is it'll retype this prompt. So for example, let's just say, um, I wanna say make image brighter. I want the face to have a false color reading of 75 CRI and then I'll click enter. And then what it will do is it'll update that JSON file. Okay, and then once it's updated, we'll come up here and we'll click copy again. And then, and then we'll just repeat the steps again and we'll just hit command V, make sure our video is uploaded as well, and then we'll hit run. And we'll just keep doing that. Now for me, this took about 11 attempts. To, so I'll show you what I've done so far. So if I come over to my window here, so this was the first image it created. So this doesn't look very good to me. It's obviously like too green, too dark, but you can see it's getting the, the lighting and the shadows correctly. It's coming together, but you'll see here, I've done multiple different prompts here. So here's the prompts I used and here's the image. And I just kept going and going until I got the iteration that I liked. And this was the final one. Now, sometimes I will prompt I will just prompt right in runway if it's a really simple thing. So for example, this image, or no, it was this one here had this weird lens flare in it. So all I did was I just came down here and I said, take out the circle in the top part of the page, keep everything else the same. And then it removed that. And then I told it to upscale to 4K. And this was the final image that it made. Okay, so there you have it. That is how you change the lighting on an image using Claude and Runway.